Howdy, this is WY6Y. This is Steven in Oklahoma City, and I have been working with the TYT TH9800 and a Digi Rig to get it working um, on Echo Link as well as WinLink. I faced some problems uh, from the from the get go. Uh, the cord, the uh, RJ12 cord that I ordered from uh, Digi Rig. Um, actually did not work, uh, would not key up the PTT, and I was no, not getting any audio out. Um, so uh, I pulled up the uh, schematics um, for TYT and for Yesu, and uh, this is what I found. This is the, vi this is the uh, schematic for the uh, RJ12 cable that is for a Yesu that uh, DigiRig sells. Um, what I ended up finding out was that it is actually... The same type of jack, an RJ12, but it is wired completely backwards. So, I w wasn't surprised after seeing that, that uh, I wasn't getting, uh, my PTT wasn't keying up, I wasn't getting any audio out. Of course I was getting audio in, because that's a separate, separate jack there. But, um, so, from there, I decided that I would take the um, cord that I ordered from DigiRig, um, this one right here, and initially I was thinking, well, I'll just splice it open and I'll uh, I'll switch the um, the wires, and uh, so I cut this part off the jack, and I was expecting to find six wires in here, and uh, I didn't. I only found three. There was uh, green, white, and bare, and so um, from there I had to. Uh, I'm going to turn this off because I'm going to show you. Uh, I had to order this adapter part. Um, got this from Amazon. This is an RJ12 um, port adapter that um, lets you, uh, you know, run your individual uh, leads into the different um, ports there um, on an RJ12. Trying to get it out here. And what I found was that when it came from Amazon, um, the collar on this thing would not let it fit. So I took a Dremel sander and sanded down the edges uh, so that it would fit in there and uh, got it, got it uh, so it would fit and uh, got everything wired backwards there on it from the way it was. Um, and I, from what I understand is that not all TYTs are actually wired this way. Uh, some of them are wired like a standard Yesu, and some of them are not. Uh, I just got this one. Um, it has this mic right here, and uh, of course it does have an RJ12 connector on it, but uh, it was backwards, and uh, it was not working. So I um, was able to get the PTT working. Um, I did use some, these are very tiny wires inside here, and I had to strip them down with a um, with a razor blade because they were too small for my uh, my wire strippers. And then I found these uh, solder stick connectors. These things are great. Um, they have a heat shrink and a piece of glue on each end and it's got a little bit of solder in the middle. So I used those to splice those wires onto some longer leads here with some good connectors at the end and um, got it all plugged in, and I'll turn it on now. Was able to get that working. I'm testing on WinLink, and um, I've gotten WinLink to work just fine, actually. Um, I'm still having uh, some peaking over here in the VU um, needle, but um, as you can see, it's keying up and connecting, and uh, I'm able to get on WinLink um, very easily. My next step is to get it working on Echo Link, which um, I've already gotten audio out and audio in. I just need to get my levels set straight on there. The number one thing that was really tripping me up, though, is that initially I thought I wasn't getting audio in, when in fact I was. Um, you have to turn off the automatic gain control inside of Windows, and um, if you are using Windows 11, your sound mixer is not the same as it was on Windows 10. And so what you have to do is you have to come down here and um, you have to go to 
more sound settings, system sound, more sound settings. And then if you come over here to recording and you right click on your digi rig and you go to properties and custom, make sure that is unchecked. If you can make sure that that is unchecked, then it just magically started, starts working. So um, anyways, um, that's how I did it. Uh, I'm not great at uh, doing little soldering and wiring jobs like this, and uh, I managed to do it. Uh, I had some frustration until I found out uh, that I needed to turn off uh, automatic gain control. I thought I wasn't getting audio in, but uh, now I am, and it all seems to be working out great. So that is the TYT TH9800 and the DigiRig Mobile Plus. Uh, actually, it's just the DigiRig Mobile. So that is, uh, that's what I'm using there. And this is WY6Y, and thank you for watching.